In the next video, we are going to continue with the forming of present perfect tense. Okay, the forming of present perfect tense. We form the present perfect tense with I, you, we, and they, with the auxiliary have, and then the past participle of the main verb. If the subject is he, she, or it, we are going to use has. He has plus past participle, she has plus past participle, it has plus past participle. Also, we can contract, okay, we can make a contraction with the verb to be, for example, uh, have and has we can contract it using v like this okay this means that I can have I instead of I have you instead of you have and will instead of we have okay and they instead of they have okay so these are contractions and they are used in conversation okay if I say I have lived in Mexico, I can say I have lived in Mexico. If I say I have spoken English, I can say I have spoken English. And it is the same. But this is more usable in conversation than in written form. In written form, we use we have or I have. In written form or formal English, Okay. Also, in reading technical books, scientific uh, readings or scientific uh, writing, you know, you have to pay attention to this. For conversation, use the contractions. For writing uh, in formal English, use the complete form. I have. I have spoken, it's okay. What I have spoken is better in communication. Now, let's continue with he has plus past participle and then has can also be contracted. Okay, has can be contracted using apostrophe S. With the pronouns, it could be he, it could be she, or it could be it. Okay, so for example, he has spoken English, el hablado English. In Spanish, we can say he's spoken English. She has uh, cleaned the room, el ha limpiado el cuarto. She's cleaned the room. She has watched television. She's watched television. It has rain. It's raining, okay? She has spoken, ella ha hablado, she's spoken. It is very important that you use the contraction in English, okay? The next video we are going to, to talk about the negative structure. Thank you for your attention. I'm not blessing.